and welcome to the Indie Gamers. I'm Scott, and Wanda's got a headache, so she's not going to join me on this. Now, we're playing a game called Meet and <clears throat> Star Mission. Um, so, let's go on ahead and start this game. I heard it was really good. In the year 3050, the male population has decreased dramatically as a result of long, bloody intergalactic wars. Now, all men are property of the United Galactic Federation are used only for reproductive purposes. In special cryogenic capsules, male individuals are shipped to different parts of the universe for the settlement of new planets. Okay. Starship shop seller 65 whatever. Okay. Whole bunch of naked dudes. System fail. Woo. Oh the the, the animations are really nice. Hey, Mr. Penis. <laughs> What's going on? Where am I? You're aboard the Starship Sower 69. <laughs> Your cryo capsule is suddenly broken. It seems you will spend the last part of the trip among our crew. Really? And where are we flying to? Your group has been sent to the reproduction center of Venus 5024. Your sperm will be used to help the population problem in that region. Oh god, I'm tired of jerking my cock to the orders of the galactic government. We're born to be free, but women use us like slaves. Sorry, dude, we all have to follow orders. Now follow me and my assistant to get you some clothes. What, they're gonna put me in women's clothing? Hello, I'm the captain's assistant, Priscilla. She told me to give you clothes and a sh ship map. You must be damn hungry after the hypersleep. Go to the dining room. You can eat something there. Okay, this is your chance. Find your way to return to the cryogenic installation area and wake up the other guys. Together you can seize power of the starship and become free. Let's see. Uh, uh, dining room. Yeah, you like it when I put my cursor over your titties. Okay. So. <laughs> Hello, bitch. Hi, beauty. My name is Chuck. Hey, baby. Want to get lucky? Um. Yeah. Hey, beauty. My name is Chuck. You must be that guy that woke up from hypersleep. What's the matter? What a hard cock. It's none of your business. Yeah, that was me. Cool, I've never seen a male person in life before. My name is Miranda. <laughs> what a suck my huge dick. Oh, just shut up and give me food. I'm damn hungry. Nice to meet you. The captain said I should eat something here. Oh, sure. What do you want, Chuck? No thanks, I'm not hungry. Could you make me a sandwich? I'd like creamy lobster soup. That would be nice. Hmm. That sounds like a sexual in you, I know, sure. Ah, I hit something wrong. I like cream to lobster soup. How do you think I can find lobster on this ship? Can you make me a sandwich? No problem, just give me a second. Bitch, just make me a sandwich. Here's your sandwich. You got a sandwich. Awesome, I have a sandwich. Um. Um. Can I help you with cooking? Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm going to make mashed potatoes, but I don't have a blender in my kitchen. I want to bang you in the ass! What are you, a nut? No, I don't want to nut. That's the thing. Can I help you make another sandwich? Sorry, I have to wait for dinner. I'm busy with cooking. Map. Engine room? Ah, here's the mechanic trying to fit something into a hole. Wash your face, it's dirty. Hey, what are you doing here? Hello, my name is Chuck. Wow, oh, it's a real guy. How did you wake up? The captain woke me up. I think she wants me to fuck her. It doesn't matter. Let's fuck her. My car capsule was damaged and I spent the rest of the trip, trip among you. Well, something goes down on the ship every time. By the way, oh, ho, 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 I get it. Something goes down on this ship every time. <laughs> I get it. 
Okay, Jocelyn, I must smell some seminal fluid. May I use your body? It seems you're trying to fix plasma pump. What's the problem? May I help you with the repair? Uh, yeah, I've been beating at it all day long, and I don't even have the time for dinner. I have a sandwich. Do you want it? Oh, thank you. Damn, I'm hungry. I'm going to put my thingy into your thingy. Can I have sex in exchange for a sandwich? I know a little about plasma punks. pumps. Can I look at it while you eat? Mm, that's the second one. What? Okay. I'll go ahead, but I don't think you can do anything. Rotate the parts and drag them into the proper position. Oh, I have it upside down. Come on. There you go. Okay, this is uh, having me think. I, I didn't think these games would make me think. <sighs> ah, there we go. And that, and on. And it works! Good job! Nice job, Chuck. You're really good at engine repair. <laughs> it's not the only thing I'm good at. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, well, maybe I'll... Maybe you'll take down your pants and... Well, that was it for Meat and Fuck. That was actually a pretty interesting game. Didn't really have that much of a story. Just go around and collect things and have sex with random women on the ship. So, um, there are also multiple endings from what I can tell. So, um, until next time, I'm Scott with the Indie Gamers, and that was an interesting experience. Let's just leave it at that. Bye now!